Welcome, Welcome to, to Cinequest, Cinequest Video. It, it, it turns it. Hey, it's me again. Yeah. Shut up, uh, un- Unfortunately, uh, Bryce uh, can't get the shit to work, so he said just to go on without him. Fuck. All right, Bryce. Well, we love you, boo boo. No. Yeah, we can try it. Hopefully, we can get it working, working next time. Yeah, that's lame, Ooh. though. Uh, all we, right. Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, Roland, go ahead. And, uh, sure so yeah, saying. like 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 I had said before, um, Ray stopped by and was like, "Here, check out this channel on YouTube." And it turns out I was already subscribed to it. <laughs> so like, I was looking, we were looking through it, and I found this like weird video, and it was called "Doctor Otto and the Riddle of the Gloom Beam." And so we look it up, and it turns out that it was uh, 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 the the first. Um, uh, the first film to feature the Ernest P. World character, you know, Jim Varney's persona. Interesting. And yeah, uh, well, uh, the thing is, is when Roland was scrolling through the, the channel, um, yeah. I saw just the thumbnail, and I was like, "Is that fucking Jim Varney?" Yeah, yeah. I mean, it you just can shows see his like, face, it doesn't right? look like him. Yeah, but it's, then, it's, like, it's like it's real like blue uh, color, right. like, and then I was like, "That fucking looks like fucking Jim Varney," and it, we w- clicked on it, so it turned out it's that the whole, was it's the whole the movie. Case. Yeah, yeah, and so like I want to dress up as that character. If you look him up, like he's he uh, uh he uh. Wait a minute. What's says, happening? Like it's got the mute symbol on on Bryce's little thing. I told him. I mean, if well, he, he can listen mic. in, it, he can listen yeah, in. Be coming up and in. off, like as we oh, go. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, if if he, he figures it out, I mean, we'll be here, so he can just join in if he wants. But Fing- um, fingers crossed, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fucking perfect, uh, in my opinion, perfect Halloween costume, though, that I want to do at some point, but I need a buddy to do it. It's to be a uh, Sir Digby Chicken Caesar. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Oh, that would be awesome, man. That's a good one. Holy shit. So dig. Chick- yeah. yeah. Well, Justin, I talked about doing it, but then, you know, hey, no, we're not together anymore. So that's not going <laughs> to <Yeah>. happen. <laughs> yeah. But she was going to be ginger and it was going to be fucking hilarious. But no. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, you can still be. Uh... Hold on. Oh, a fuck, clue. So like... <laughs> <laughs> see. So, like, there's the link to the movie. And Legend. here is the fucking link to. Well, this is the Amazon. Like trying to find an image of uh, of Jim Varney's character. I'll do that right quick. I'll lean forward and Google it. Boop. Uh, yeah, but I still want to put it on the board because <laughs> he looks fucking hilarious. And uh, Ray could be Buckethead. Either you should be the Buckethead robot Ray, or again, show enough. Well, yeah. I mean, the show enough character. Uh, I would love to wear the sunglasses first of all. So uh, there's that. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, I would need a wig, obviously. You know. Yeah, I mean, but that's it's like a bucks, baby. You can save up for it. Oh fuck. Portland. Yeah, I need to save up for it. I mean, it's just be fucking there. <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah! I want. That's what I want to be next year. Fuck yes. Then I mean, dedicate yourself to making that fucking costume, man. Because I mean, that looks like that's a serious a lot dedication. Of, that's right elaborate. There. It's, yeah, it yeah. looks like just like a bunch of shit from Hobby Lobby or from like Michael Oh yeah, most definitely. Just crap. spray yeah. painted a different hobbies, color or back, something. Need you know? a beer. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. Um. I, I I watched most of it. It doesn't make any sense. It's like it's like a VHS fucking or like an old MTV video a music video marathon. Right. Right. Um, they fucking like they it'll just it'll flash between like Ernest or Doctor Otto in his lab and then like. Uh, over to the people he's terrorizing, which are usually like bankers or like like people that own businesses and that kind of shit. They're like, why isn't the check or why why isn't the credit card scanner working or what happened to all our money? And, you know, and then boom, it just goes back to him and he'll be like, Sayonara <laughs> London or some kind of shit, you know. And uh, So I, I, I got through maybe like half of it and then I took a nap and just let it play, play the rest through. And so, I mean... It, very uh it's very relaxing nap uh i would have to say but, uh hello pretty cool um, right on but uh yeah so okay so uh i guess cool. we'll get started with the actual oh right movie here we go uh <laughs> oh wait right that's what we're doing today yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. our, our our jibber jabber can continue on after. Just let ah. the, whoever's listening know that what we're actually talking about. I mean, and, uh, yeah. So, um, because it usually uh, ends up talking about the movie regardless. We are talking about Ernest in general. So, um, the late great Jim Varney. Yes. Uh, welcome to Cinequest Video episode. Who knows? It's the Halloween special, and today we're going to be talking about I the think movie it's Ernest is Scared Stupid. Mm, or I don't know. Or twenty six or twenty seven. I'm not too sure. It's um, twenty seven. Yeah. Yeah, it's one of those. Whatever, it doesn't matter. And uh, since uh, it's the Halloween episode, uh, I think it was Daniel. Was this something you suggested, or was it Bryce? I'm not too sure. Um, someone, some, point. someone in our in our situation. Some wise person said. <laughs> yes, one of one of us in our uh, wisdom decided that hey, for Halloween we should do uh, Ernest is Scared Stupid, and it just so happened that we acquired. Uh, this movie, along with the rest of the Every Ernest collection, amazing movie, in and uh, we couldn't have been happier and more excited to say yes to record a episode of Ernest because we all fucking love Ernest P. Whirl, and um, this is awesome. probably one of our favorite movies. Well, it's one of mine. I mean, did you, did you guys uh, ever watch this TV series on uh, on cable back in the day? What was it called? Uh, the Ernest uh, Ernest World or something like that. No. no, I didn't. I had no idea yeah. that that was, it was a TV show. Oh, man. yeah, dude. It was on, uh, it was uh, like when I had basic cable, I think it was like channel 30. It was the fam, the, the fam, the fam channel or the family channel. And then I think later on it became ABC family or some shit like that in later yeah. 90s. But, uh, oh, fucking, I loved it. For Great. once, we're going to take your word for it. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on. To quote you, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, Vern, it's Ernest. Uh, here we go. TV series ran from 1988, has one season. Um, it was on Saturday mornings, and I'm trying to find where it says which. Enough, Roland. We already said we took your word for it. Shut up. I have, <laughs> I have, I have, I have, I have proof. Yeah, I got goddamn. evidence in this motherfucker. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. You goddamn naysays, non-believers. Here's my knowledge claim, and I'm gonna back it up. That's right. Slap you in the face with it. Pop, slap, 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 slap. <laughs> All right. I'm well, done. be a first. You know. So. Hey, can anyone hear me? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey. hey. What fuck, fuck yeah, dude. Yes. yes, we can hear you, man. Oh, what I did, I just fucking I was using Firefox and I said, fuck this. Uh, so I went to Google Chrome and now it's working just fine. So. Oh, awesome. Fuck That's yeah. funky. Yo, wait. So, like, you're using Chrome you're using, to. Yeah, you're not using the Discord app, like on the computer box? Oh, well, that's what I asked Ray. Ray said to just use the browser. So, that was your oh, first really? mistake. Oh, oh I, first... I used the browser on the, on the mini. I mean, uh, it's your first mistake, Bryce. You're asking Ray. Well, I'm yeah, sorry. I don't know much about computers, but I just know what I know from what I use. So. <laughs> I I wouldn't have said it that way, Ray, but that statement alone is hilarious enough. I don't know much about computers, but like, all right. All but right. I know what I know, and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, that is the weirdest defense. <laughs> awesome. Uh, well, okay. I could say I said I only I know what I know from my own experience, right? There you and go. That's yeah. what I can give yeah. advice to. Try, try if I don't know if something's completely out of my wheelhouse, I'll very well say I don't know. So whatever. Google it. There you go. Uh, cool though. I like you. You you're coming in pretty pretty strong there, man. Yeah, you're coming in pretty clear, man. So you haven't missed anything. We were just <clears throat> getting started. <laughs> Well, I think he's been listening the whole time, but he hasn't uh, yeah. been able to contribute. So. Oh, okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, okay, so, uh, so ahead, like uh, we said before, uh, let me just do the intro all over again. <laughs> uh, well, never mind, fuck it, whatever. Uh, Wait, so yeah, we're we talking recording? about uh, Ernest Scared <laughs> Stupid, and um, the um, this movie came out October 11th, 1999. It is categorized as fantasy horror it could wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Hey, no, Ray. 81, 91, sorry. 91. 91. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Jim Barney was holy dead holy. by that point, man. <laughs> yeah. so, uh, Posthumous release of this. Did I say 2001? Yeah. You said 1999, yeah. bud. Well, he died in 2000, so technically yeah. he was not dead yeah. yet. Uh, 1991, sorry. Literally. Um, gotcha. It is rated PG. <laughs> Again, c- categorized as fantasy horror. And it yeah. does star uh, Jim Varney, which is famously known for his character. Uh, Ernest P. Worrell, and this is, I think, the 
third movie. It was the, uh, either the third or fourth. Yeah, movie it's, 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 like, the, it's the fifth. Ernest, the it was like, oh, was it the fifth role? Yeah, yeah. So it's, um, uh, it's the fifth Ernest goes to camp was the first one. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, the official Ernest go does something. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, it's not. I'm not talking about like the first movie that uh, Jim, like uh, Ernest comes out into, but like one of the yeah. first uh, in the library yeah. of Ernest goes yes, does right. feels you're something. Right. You're right. You're right, you're um, right. But yeah, so I think it's like number four, or number five. I'm not too sure, but. Um, Ernest Goes to Camp was the first one. It was the fourth. Yeah, you're right. That was the fourth one? Okay. Yeah, Ernest Goes to Camp, Ernest Saves Christmas, Ernest Goes to Jail, and then this gym. This is movie. this one, right, right, right. Um, I actually wasn't, I was more familiar with the first three. Um, I didn't see this one until like way later. Mm-hmm. Um, I think this one did like come a, out in the theaters, but it kind of just like fell off at some point because it didn't, obviously, doesn't get really good reviews and stuff like that. So, yeah. Was like an Ernest goes to Africa or something too or something. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was like the last yeah. one he did on the, okay. the Ernest goes to like yeah. series. Yeah, and that one's so bad. It, I wasn't it's, it straight to straight to VHS or whatever kind of. I think. Yeah, well, like, he went straight to brownface. I'll say. I'll say. That. <laughs> <laughs> he I totally mean, like so... impersonated a fucking like servant at this like honky fucking like golf club thing or whatever oh okay and he's like i can't remember what the fucking name he gave himself but it was just so, like like oh, yo kajid will listen to you kajid will yeah but he's totally in brown so, face that's what like, i was telling him on his head and shit it's fucking wild man so i was telling ray earlier that i'm surprised you know like they had the leprechaun in the hood and tales from the hood and i was like i'm, mm. I'm you know i'm surprised i didn't just decide to do like an Ernest goes to the hood or something <laughs> 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 Ernest gets shot well, I, I read Ernest, something Ernest like goes to Compton. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I read I read somewhere a little earlier that uh, they were working on an Ernest goes to space thing. Uh, uh, oh shit! Like, oh, that been so good. Everything but, else. But uh, it was rumored that they he had started <laughs> filming it, <laughs> but he this? died. Right. It was so he didn't now? finish it. They it was it was kind of rumored that he had started filming it, but yeah. he died, so they didn't get to finish it. But actually, that. It was it was just a rumor that really didn't happen. But the talks of Ernest goes to space was going to be a thing. Yeah, well, which would have been awesome. awesome. You know? Yeah. I mean, if Jason Voorhees can go to space, why the fuck not Ernest? Right. It'd be some bullshit though. Where, like Ernest's intelligence is like similar to a chimpanzee's, and they were like trying to revitalize the space program. <laughs> so, but they wanted to like some speaking versus just you know physiological reactions to being in space like yeah that that would have probably been like the kick the kicking off point to that shit <laughs> um i mean he had I wanna, to have a device to help him pass high school basically so <laughs> <laughs> um i want to give a read a little quick synopsis of the movie just to give everyone anyone who's listening an uh, idea if they have not seen it before so uh, Ernest P. Worrell uh, is working as a garbage collector in a small Missouri town. Despite the warnings of superstitious, superstitious local old lady Hackmore, he accidentally unleashes devious troll Trantor, a slimy creature confined underneath a tree for 200 years. Trantor changes some kids into wooden dolls and turns Ernest's dog, Rimshot, into a log. Ernest then teams up with old lady Hackmore to get rid of the beast and bring the victims back to life. And speaking of old lady Hackmore, ready. though, y'all know who that was, right? Catwoman. Catwoman. Yeah, Catwoman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Still got it. Actually, when I was watching it earlier, um, well, actually, I was no, gonna say the voice to the bad lady in uh, Emperor's New Groove, but that yeah, was she's more, <laughs> that was. Yeah, I, was, uh, I, was just, I think <laughs> Ernest Scared Stupid was her, her most proudest moment, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was, when I was watching the it garbage earlier, lady like. Yeah, she has like a bunch of garbage in front of her fucking house and shit. Sure. No, no, they're, they're expressions, expressions of the soul. That's right. Mm-hmm. Expressions of the soul. Soul. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Yeah, you didn't worst, watch it two times the last like five God, hours. So. The worst, the worst fucking stupidest, artsiest crap you could shit out. Yeah. Well, at least she, <laughs> she didn't say like juxtaposition. Oh, God. No. Or, or, <laughs> God damn it. Thank you. <laughs> I'm just, I hate that word so much. You know, I when I was watching it again, again, I haven't really like. It's been a while since I watched an Ernest movie. I, mean, I think the last one I'd watched was years ago, which was uh, Ernest Goes to Camp. But mm-hmm. I was realizing that he's pretty much like 
a Don Knotts kind of character. Yeah. Like he's he's pretty much like Don Knotts, right? And am I wrong in thinking that? No. Do y'all know who Don Knotts? Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got no. that uh, uh got that like rubber face or whatever. Right, right, yeah. I mean, I think I said this earlier to you guys that he's like a redneck Pee Wee Herman, so because all yeah. the inventions <laughs> yeah, yeah. and shit. Yeah, I can so see that. yeah. Um, uh, <laughs> I, I thought one of the greatest lines when they called him the uh, the great redneck hope. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then like he's like, and then he, and he totally it. owns yeah. it. He's just yeah, like exactly. Ernest uh, P. Worrell, the great, the great redneck, redneck hope. hope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fucking awesome. A fucking beam of light shines down on him. Shit. Fucking hilarious. So awesome. Um which starts off with him almost uh, getting killed by a by his Compactor. own device, yeah. 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 <laughs> he, he did. He was in there, right? When it closed in on him, like, how yeah, he was yeah. there. Yeah, so he yeah. came out in that like lump of garbage or whatever. I was surprised he, he didn't die, he, though. Like, I, I thought mean, he was gonna come out like mask style, like even flat and shit, and like <laughs> part, part it up. I I loved when when he falls in there and like he's looking around for shit to like to to stop it, and he ends up like you know he gets that. Uh, like a, a, a car muffler that doesn't work. He gets a, a shovel also doesn't work. And then he gets a fucking like a baby doll. Oh, that conversation is yeah. like, it's like, no, don't put my no. face in there. The harness. I know where you live or whatever. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> but it's me or you. I have a family at the doll factory. I'll send you a nice <laughs> car. No, you'll never get away with this. I know where you live. Fucking, and that you know, works. and he's, he's just about to fucking die. And he's like having this conversation with yeah, a fucking yeah. doll, right? And on uh, that you know, note, what, what was like, that? Was that thing he, he pulled jumping out the ahead battery a little right? bit? But this probably the funniest thing that occurred to me of this entire movie, which spread through the series, um, is when he and Kenny in the in the fucking treehouse, like uh, fending off the fucking troll horde. Yeah, and oh, Ernest yeah. goes through all his personalities, and yeah. Kenny's <laughs> like, "Oh, great! I'm stuck up here with a bunch of multiple personalities." So my right. thinking was. What if, to the perspective of like the people that fuck with Ernest, except in Ernest goes to jail when he actually impersonates his aunt or whatever to try to escape, yeah. um, that it's just him, just like assuming these various personas with no costumery. Oh, <laughs> he's just a just fucking man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, I was thinking that when he was doing that with the kid in the garage. Oh, the yeah. kid. Yeah, 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 the kid was there. Yeah, when, 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 when he did with the kid in the garage, like, the, the, the kid seemed to notice that he was like. I don't know. I mean, maybe not. That would be funny though if they cut to him and he's just like fucking making all these different yeah faces. Uh, which like which by, by the way, Bush one, one of them, yeah, he the has like the brown face. The the the, okay, yeah. One the of them he puts lady. on the brown face, you know. Yeah, the Ottoman, the Ottoman warrior. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he does. I, I mean, like he does like off brown face or whatever, like off brown. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. Like right when he so he's uh, got a nice tan. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> So he's also because he also does it in the beginning of the movie when he plays that like his uh, his ancestor or whatever who's cursing Trantor. Mm, right, right. And like yeah. you could see like, wait a minute, like did he like his face like it's got a little got a Which is interesting there. to my knowledge, they didn't call that troll fucking Trantor in the entire fucking movie. So it's interesting well, how they came up in the fucking description of the movie. Like, oh yeah, they, they did though. Come they, up. Yeah. They, they did oh, like they? once yeah, 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 like once or twice. Um yeah. I think in the beginning of it, the movie they call it's him not Trantor. very clear because they I think they just like uh, they say like Trantor like very yeah. like the very it, beginning. It, it's not very clear that they're they're well, saying they're putting that. Him under and the then, tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, and, and they then, say his name. Yeah, because it's isn't it well um uh well not Ernest but the the ancestor who says it isn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah and yeah. then so when Ernest first summons him, he's like. You know, when he's parroting everything, you know, oh, if yeah, a world right. comes into a tree and puts his hand on the tree and says, I summon thee, and he says, Trantor. And, there you go. And the, oh, okay. I guess I was just drunk. My bad. <laughs> like, they really yes. don't mention I'm it. I was like, drinking when I watched this. Like, it was. Ah, oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Yeah. It, that, it was yeah. pretty good. This is one of the. I really wanted to watch. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to watch this later without. Maybe I'll, I'll put it on in the background on Halloween or some shit while I'm drinking. And I was going to ask you that Watch picture that you put Hocus up Pocus, on you know? uh, earlier. Um, yeah. Uh, have you seen the movie? Yeah. So I was watching it earlier uh, today. Oh, actually, weird. I just found it. It's uh, Doctor. It's on YouTube, man. It's. Uh, I actually put a link on there for the whole thing. Uh, it's called Doctor Otto and the Gloom Beam. And yeah, it's, yeah it's, no, that was Ray, news Ray to that me, Ray that channel I sent you. Um, or I think the one oh, you sent well, me. That's, a, that's exactly I think what it's I, on I, there. 
Yeah, well, that's, that's where that's, that's where we got it from. Yeah. So yeah. like, um, yeah, Ray. Ray it's, it's funny. Ray it's funny me, uh, you're saying that. I, I told him I was like, Bryce sent me a channel, and apparently I was already subscribed. But I think it's because you told me about it a while back, and I subscribed, and then I kind of forgot about it. Yeah. And then I told Roland, okay. and then Roland looked on his YouTube channel, and he was like, "Oh, I'm subscribed to it too." I think I told him about it, and then we just <laughs> kind of forgot about it. And then we yeah. were scrolling down, and we happened to come across that movie, and then I was like, "Oh shit, that's Jim Varney on there." And then it turns out it was. So. Yeah, yeah, Jim Varney with the fucking hand on his head. Yeah, right, it's yeah, yeah. fucking great. Like that thing, it like moves every so often. Like the, they put an actual hand, and it just like it pets him or whatever, like thing from Adam's Family or some shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, it's pretty funny, dude. Like. It makes no sense. Like I was telling Ray earlier, is like watching a, a fucking MTV uh, Greatest Hits Marathon or something back when it, you know, <laughs> crash. Um, but so back to the movie, I guess. Uh, did, oh, real quick, uh, when, when he was in the the, the, the trash compactor, uh, yeah. he, did he pull apart like the the battery from the? Yes, that's how it ends. Yeah, like so. It, no, no, no. It, it didn't end because, like, for some reason, the current still like exactly. It arcs. Current, the, yeah, yeah the he, he pulls the battery off the remote and it fucking arcs, and <laughs> then he gets crushed. <laughs> like, I fucking yeah. love that. It was so great. Um, so I don't mind CG like that. Like, it's not, it's not obvious. It's not too fucking ridiculous. It's just like little, little shit like that was fucking. Uh, fucking well, cool, I mean, if you're gonna, I mean, you're gonna see any special effects in this movie. I mean, the practical, practical effects for the, yeah, the practical effects, the for troll them. were look pretty cool. Yeah, um, like everything else, obviously, I, like, that's like I fake. thought the trolls, pretty... like the costumes for the trolls, look pretty damn good. Um, they look almost for, killer clown for an from space movie. Like, I mean, yeah, the yeah. practical effects were pretty amazing. Yeah. I wonder how much they spent on that. What was the budget for the movie? Do you know? Uh, let's. I don't see. know, but it, it made fourteen some million dollars in the theater. So I don't yeah. know how much it would actually. And I will cost say this: call back to our last scene quest for Blade, the explosion scenes from the trolls beat oh, Deacon Frost's <laughs> explosion hands down. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, God, so much better. Um, but uh, so did any of you guys think it was really stupid that like the trolls were like four feet tall or whatever? Like they're supposed to be super threatening and shit, and they're like knee high to nothing. They're super wide. They're not tall. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're, so, they're real thick. They're like, they're like, like we're not tall, but you know? we're. It's about the girth, wide. you know. It's not <laughs> yeah. about the length. It's about girth. Right there, we go. It's girth. They're gonna, they're, they're, they won't. Was it? They won't reach the bottom, but they will stretch out the edges. <laughs> um. So let's it go to. Uh, yeah, we ended off with him like. So when I was watching this movie, for the most part, like I just skipped through all the scenes with the kids the like the second time I was watching it because like you could watch this without pretty much like seeing anything having to do with any of the other characters and like it would still be a you know, you can get like the gist of everything, just watching Ernest's character. And right, uh, right, that's right, yeah. that's also yeah. when all the good shit happens. The kids the kids are just like they're extras or whatever. They're fucking irritating. Uh and, uh, yeah, what the how, how, how are you gonna figure man? out that amazing fucking tree that house. treehouse was the shit. Holy fuck, man! I was just <laughs> like, just "Fuck you guys!" Or did exactly. Like that? I mean, well, I right. them, like he was there helping, like in with the, all the, the stuff he collected for it, years. It, it, guys, this is a very <laughs> different, very different time, man. Because they're letting, <laughs> they're letting, they're letting uh, all their make... kids go off with the fucking garbage guy. Yeah, in the, and middle like, of the, forest. In the <laughs> forest. They're not <laughs> necessarily because they're like, you should be hanging out with the war Ernest, like later. But they're not uh, really trying too hard to keep him away. Yeah. I don't know, man. This is a different time. They like make they're making like potato guns and shit, like. Uh, yeah exactly they made like some high tech fucking weaponry in that treehouse <laughs> like, those ice blasters fuck the, the goddamn potato can la- uh, potato gun uh, can launchers canned food launchers but that, that thing had a seat though right like, yeah the kid yeah, turned yeah. around it, it, it was like, a fucking turret it yeah it was a turret <laughs> it, was like, it was like a fucking uh, aircraft carrier like style <laughs> fucking yeah, gun it just fucking like lowered themselves into it really um I I thought it was the funniest shit when they introduced the the old lady though like when Ernest goes to meet her and she like screams in his face and then like all she all of a sudden she busts out the 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 fucking torch uh right. oh, just like yeah. pops it right in his yeah. face the, the, I thought the, I, I thought they were going to cut to a scene of his face like all burned up or something Yeah but they yeah, just like cut it's away. all smoky and shit and he's like <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, I guess like I'll come back later there, and she like screams at him and turns on this fucking blowtorch in his face <laughs> like uh so is he dead like what the fuck um <laughs> and so how old is this bitch though because that was something too right like when when did when did they first 
like when in the first uh, the troll was first buried, like it made it look okay, like it just said long ago. It just said long ago. That's all it said. Well, yeah. But the <laughs> thing is, uh, <laughs> Ernest said his great great granddaddy. Yeah. So yeah, that's, that's a good point because because uh, she had those right. fucking like w- her, the wooden dolls that she saved, I guess, right, from the last yeah. fucking troll yeah. nonsense, and then they get revived and they're like, somehow. Right. Um, <laughs> hey, but, it's, it's it's a it's the nun. Doesn't it actually like, give you a date on when it happened. No, no, no. It no. just says long. Curious, like it's all. supposed to be like medieval folklore, but like it's in fucking America and like. Well, no, yeah. it's it doesn't seem like medieval folklore though. Like the books do that. Uh, yeah, they do. The actually they, no, like so he's talking about the book, right? Like which would suggest that it was older than when they actually uh, buried him. So maybe maybe it went back further. Uh, but but in the movie. He yeah, says yeah. great great da- great great granddaddy put like the troll away to begin with. So so we're talking three generations. It says uh, on the Wikipedia here that uh the troll transforms children and wooden dolls to feast on there out of Missouri in the late nineteenth century. So yeah. Late eighteen hundreds. Okay, that, that tracks, right. I guess. Okay, so But that still make also, her old as fuck. Yeah. And so it's like, how is she still alive? Like <laughs> exactly. Like, how'd you get so old? Like, 200 uh, years old, sister. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe she has some kind of magical powers, too, that they don't mm-hmm. ever Well, she could have fucking used them with the troll, huh? Like, I, I loved how, well, like, they first she was, she, I don't think she had, like, easy access to milk. No, right. <laughs> That's true. But no, but she could have made, like, the troll levitate or something. They, like, don't fuck with me. Boop, they, you're in the air now. They probably didn't have uh, access to our pasteurization technologies, uh, and they just had to drink it straight from the milk, from the cow teat, or not at all. Whatever. I assume. Uh, and you're but, not going to waste that shit, you know, on nothing, you know, because, no, like, man, it's, uh, they have, it's, like, you know, one sip of fucking cow tit per week, you know, for their rations. Right. So they, you got to find off that. <laughs> osteoporosis somehow uh so did you guys like how Ernest's character was introduced because they they start off with the little girl telling that story right and so she finishes and ends with like oh yeah they're it's part of the curse every generation of worlds gets dumber, stupid, and dumber. dumber yeah then there's and, then Ernest, it's just, yeah. and then it's this fucking like old face or whatever on there <laughs> uh yeah they they hired me as a sanitary engineer they have no idea they actually uh uh hired a what is it what did he call himself uh fucking um the man of destiny the ruler of refuse uh, <laughs> <laughs> a man who has taken dominion over the environment uh the the czar of of jars the baron of bottles <laughs> the duke of dust <laughs> yeah um i fucking love his dog though rimshot is fucking hilarious and it's like and I would have to argue that the dog is smarter than Ernest. I, I mean, oh yeah, most same definitely. Yeah. It's yeah. not yeah. a strong yeah. argument. It doesn't need to be. Because <laughs> like in that truck scene in the beginning, where oh, like Rimshot's God. fucking with the controls, it's like, all right, it's like, Rimshot's trying to get rid of Ernest. He's like, you're holding me back <laughs> from <laughs> being on some Kibbles commercial fucking, or some bullshit. Exactly. Like, <laughs> the fucking dog knows how to. The fucking dog knows how to drive. He's yelling at it. Hit the clutch. Hit the clutch. Well, like, I mean, later in the movie, fucking on his own, on his own behalf, driving, on his own yeah. accord, fu- yeah, he just yeah, fucking he like driving, yeah. jumps down on the fucking gas, like to go, yeah. like, <laughs> and then he like tells him, hit it in reverse, and the fucking dog leaps <laughs> over, <laughs> and it hits the shift, the the shifter, and fucking runs him over, like ah, uh, that was that was awesome. Uh, yeah, that scene was pretty funny. I I actually rewound it like two times because the whole dog driving was it's cute as fuck, and it was funny. So. Yeah, I mean, um, what does he say? Uh, uh, when he's fighting, when he's fighting the troll. Hold on. I bet. Uh, no. I thought you took notes the second time around. Uh, yeah, I did, but I got a lot of shit here. <laughs> <laughs> I got a lot of shit here. Um, he uh, he fucking tells him, uh, like, when he's fighting him, he like knocks over his hedge clippers or whatever. And he's like, he reaches back and pulls out some nunchucks. He's like, yeah, little did you know, I'm a master of hedge clip keto. Yeah. <laughs> the, the secret oriental fighting style of Japanese gardeners. Like, oh, that's like almost, that's like almost racist. But hey, like that was fucking, that, that works. You know what? Like, were those the, the, uh, the troll uh, uh, ninja nunchucks that he got from the store? Or were, they, were those just like some shit he found at the 
Oh, no, I there. think they were from shrug. the store. I, 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 I he, thought had, was, he had he had purchased thought, all that stuff already. He did, by that but time, like they look know? different. Like I think he those were just, uh, how, you know, like I almost thought they were like sausage links. <laughs> he just fucking like brings out some food or some shit. Fucking, um, that's where Ninja Turtles got the idea from, man. Oh fuck, yeah. <laughs> Ninja Turtles too. Um, um, troll, yeah, speaking troll of, Ninja speaking of uh, the stuff that he purchased at the store, I mean, he went to the store looking for stuff and it turned the guy who runs the place tells oh, him that yeah. he was like a oh uh, he uh, was like a uh, head of the troll like infantry or some shit like that oh this yeah. is really here i <laughs> got it, like I, got a day, it. I was in the 82nd troll like repulsion infantry or whatever the yeah. fuck yeah in charge God of the damn. troll destruction unit yeah there you go i like when he's like naming all the shit that he's purchased from him and then at the end he's like did you include like the the troll oh, love songs, the, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. the giant album with every troll love song ever. Right, and the guy's yeah, like, but it's funny though; he has all that shit. Like, I mean, it's not stuff he just made up. Like, where did he, where did he get that stuff? I mean, I just thought he, he was may, full of he shit. He may have not have been bullshitting. He's been telling the truth or something. Some, well, yeah, somebody had a, actually made all that shit, like the uh, love song for troll, all the way sprays, <laughs> I'm proof troll gloves, day glow troll waiters, no troll strips, uh, chopped troll bait. <laughs> <laughs> trolling motor the the fucking troll ninja so it's just chopped up children you got to keep that shit fresh uh so what those missing that? kids in the briarville community yeah what is he? I, I like don they, and uh bobs yeah uh, there you go don and bobs <laughs> i like how they ended that though when he asked when he asked him it's like is it include the giant album with every troll love song ever and he's like do rattlesnakes kiss was it cautiously or carefully and then you hear the fucking drum roll from, uh, yeah. from Bob. <laughs> like, out of nowhere. You hear the um, rim shot. Yeah. Oh, shit. yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. It was like 1700 bucks, though. Like, they're yeah. like, <laughs> Ernest plus tax. Money. Yeah, yeah exactly. Like, right, cool. I was like, yeah. I'm, I'm hey, good with this. Hey, garbage men get paid pretty well. So shit. Yeah, yeah, they do now. <laughs> um, okay, so... It, He's purchased the stuff already, and then they find out that the m- milk or milk is uh, the thing that kind of like repulses the. Well, the they trolls. find out later, right? At first, they find out later, but it's because like, it's yak. Because you know, yeah, Ernest yak, can't yeah. read. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like mid. Yeah, they had to find some of this, huh? Brand yeah, yeah. was it? Yeah, the I saw I like I looked up I looked it up earlier. It's on it, it is on Urban Dictionary, and it's funny because it mentions it specifically. Oh yeah, I was first introduced in in an Ernest movie, um, <laughs> and uh, as as a fictional uh, fucking thing. But he support- finds some, and he's like, "Oh, yeah. uh, I bet you couldn't. I bet you didn't think I could find some this time of year." And like, right. it was in, it was <laughs> in, <laughs> it, it was in season. What did yeah. you tell him? Eat, nah, nah, eat. Come on, eat me, I can die. <laughs> Um, what is it? I kind of wondered uh, when I first saw the movie as a kid. I was like, "Well, he's talking about finding it in the season." I was like, "Yeah," I was like, "What the fuck is this?" Um, I looked it up though, and apparently somebody made it into a beer. It's like a stout. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> um, but uh, it's really funny when he's like reading that. Uh, when he's Next reading that old text. Miak. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> Tell Jamie. Jamie's fucking all about stouts, isn't he? He'll fuck, track it down. Uh, it was like Bavarian Miak or something like that. So I think they're fans of this movie uh, at the very <laughs> least. Um, but uh, what is he? He's like, he's trying to read the text and he's like, M I something something K. Look. Oh, I have to check his, <laughs> check his ruin somehow. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, you can't read. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I didn't notice until like. I, I like I'd forgotten when I originally saw this movie that the fucking troll has two noses. Yeah. Oh, yeah. like oh, it's, word. It's so gross. Like I was like, what is wrong with his like split nose? Oh, it's always running too, man. It's because like, he's booger lips. Yeah. Yeah. Oh <laughs> uh, man, how like, do you like that booger lips? <laughs> what <has he> got? <laughs> uh, there's a there's a few of them, right? It's not wad, it's not locker, booger lips. Yeah, Double but Burgos is used like multiple times in the movie. Yeah, it's fucking hilarious. Yeah, yeah. I heard Snotwood a couple times and Booger Lips, Squid Lips, uh, mm-hmm. Double well, doesn't Ugly. He say something regarding funny. about his uh, his nose or like he's saying like I noticed that you oh, had yeah. like a cold or like a like um, sinus problems or something since we first met or something. It's right when he's, I think I he's think about so. to like throw the 
the milk, milk at him or something. So like the I think he does, but I know like the when he's in the old lady persona, he tells uh he tells the trolls or whatever, well, she, I guess. Uh um a little nasal hygiene would go a long way, young man. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> and, like, she dumps it on and she's like, I hope you're grateful. Little trolls in China don't even get milk. <laughs> like, <what the laughs> yeah, that was fucking hilarious. Yeah. I should have written that shit down when I was watching that show. Like, God was, damn. Yeah. She's trolls fucking, in China don't even get that shit. She's yeah. She's fucking hilarious. She's like, a woman's work is never done. And, like, <laughs> like <laughs> fucking just Well, that's my favorite, probably my favorite, like Ernest persona, though. Like, yeah. I mean, he was that to try to get out of jail, and Ernest goes to jail jail like talking about how her son is so disappointed in him and then mm-hmm. almost he almost gets out the fucking gates so we talked about how disappointed that guy's mother would be in him <laughs> by like stopping an old lady or whatever <laughs> i almost wonder if that was like his actual like him projecting his actual grandmother or whatever Oh, kind of dude, funny. but but on the real though man that fucking character reminds me of my grandmother like without the walker and shit but like yeah mm-hmm. but but yeah, Janice was told it had that like tone of voice and shit. Oh and wow, that like yeah, dude. that's harsh. That's harsh. It's just what it is, man. It's just fucking funny, man. Just yeah. that that fucking aunt of Ernest's character always fucking reminded my own grandmother, man. It's fucking so fucking what fucking funny. So like, I was trying to think of ways to describe the trolls, and I I like I got a few, and I kind of wanted to float them by you guys just to see what you think. Um, so one of them was like, I kind of thought they looked like if Jabba the Hutt and Miss Piggy had a butt baby. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Um, it was like, I kind of thought they were like half gremlin, half old man ball sack. Um, <laughs> and then the last one I got was like, if Yoda fucked a dwarf. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, good job, Roland. Oh. I'm uh I'm impressed by your descriptive uh descriptiveness of these trolls here. Yeah, you put that shit on the t shirt, man. Um, <laughs> All right. Uh, speaking so of any, any more like accurate. quotes, does anyone have any more quotes? I have a few, but I don't know if any of you gonna bring quotes. it up though. Um doop, doop, doop. Well, I mean I got a shitload. Uh, uh the, I, I, if I may, the the one I wanna yeah, just ahead. say f- uh, first is whenever the troll makes his first appearance and he's like uh they're in the, he's in the treehouse with Ernest and Ernest mm-hmm. tells him, um, I saw Hulkamania three times. Yeah, and once yeah, yeah. slow mo and slow mo. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I don't mess with me, like, and then uh, like he just breaks down. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't kill. <laughs> yeah, before he lists off all like the mash martial arts oh, right. he's like, like, yeah, right. expert in, I know Sha- and Shaolin. I watched Hulkamania. Yeah, like Tai Chi, Chow Mein. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was fucking awesome. Um, the two, two, two. I I loved it when he was going to go like help when he's helping the kids find a treehouse. You know, he like knocks on one and it's like it rings hollow. He's like, oh, too much bass. You know, he knocks on the other. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he knocks on the other and it's like, oh, this will work. And it like knock, it falls over. Like, oh, too many termites. Like, uh, ha, ha, ha. and then um, he finds another one. And he looks up and a bird shits in his face. <laughs> yeah, this one's occupied. Is what yeah, he said. there you go. <laughs> They're like, and then, and then like they see the evil as fuck looking like little area or whatever and he's like oh this is neat like, what the fuck really <laughs> yeah. like let's go you know like okay heart of a child man heart of a child yeah. um and the kids are like should we be doing this and he he tells him he's like remember uh if any of us get separated there's an old pioneer way of finding north uh the bark always grows on the outside of the tree <laughs> <laughs> like what <laughs> like I, I had to, i had to hear that a few times before i was like yeah okay <laughs> no all right but he did say that for sure cool um uh what did you did you like so i thought that the the troll pods or whatever the troll egg egg pods look like like di- like disease ridden ball sacks or something they were just fucking gross <laughs> like i missed the part where they were like coming out of the tree the first time uh w- when i saw it and uh i i almost thought that like the troll laid the laid them like eggs and i was like Ugh. no no yeah yeah no like they, they just they grew from the tree of, themselves yeah. from or they they dangle from they the look tree. like brussels sprouts oh, yeah brussels sprouts. i hate brussels sprouts <laughs> yeah what, um let's see i think uh one of the other quotes i wanted to say was uh when trantor they're in the car and trantor like 
uh, he rips off the door. Oh yeah, uh, to the car, and he's like, or before I think it's just before that, he's like, "You will pay for the sins of your forefathers." Yeah, he says, "I didn't, I didn't have, have forefathers. forefathers. I only had yeah. one, and I didn't know him that well." <laughs> yeah, didn't know him that well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, he like he like puts his foot like he locks the door. And he's like, "Ha ha, I'm smarter, ah, than, smarter you. than you." <laughs> the troll rips the fucking door off. Yeah, <laughs> nah, like and then he like abandons Rimshot in the front seat to like jump out the back window, like right. Like, really? <laughs> All right, uh, let the dog. But that, that fucking troll can move fucking fast, though, man. Like, I don't yeah. know if that was like sped up film or something because as Ernest gets out of that fucking window, that troll hauls ass and like yeah. gets out of that window, too. But you know, in terms of human behavioral ecology, which posits that people will basically maximize resources, the yeah. troll was at the heart of that in the beginning of the movie or towards the beginning of the movie when he's following the, the kid, right? Kenny and that little chick to uh lady hathorns or whatever fuck her name Hack, is hackmore yeah, yeah. Hackmore, yeah. Hackmore, yeah hackmore there you go and then you see this little kid putting on a bike he's just like nope <laughs> scoop that up <laughs> yeah that was really funny yeah the camera just pans over like what peace you know fucking goes and gets him yeah that was, i got one that now awesome. i'm at two <laughs> um so i think there was like three moments in this movie where Ernest is like real fucking like uh what's it uh like he's he like completely acts in his own self-interest and is like fuck everyone else um we already went over one of them was when like he stuffs the baby doll into the gears to save himself. <laughs> yeah. you know, but, and like it wouldn't, that wouldn't have counted if 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 he hadn't invented a whole persona for the baby no you can't do this to me i've got family he's like uh that's cool i'll send him a card you know boop. Stuff, oh, stuff in there. <laughs> and uh and then the second one was when um when the kids go uh meet him at uh lady hack hackthorn's place or whatever and uh she's like uh you know the troll needs four more souls before he can re- you know release his army and and uh start to capture the children all over the world and he fucking smiles he's like just the kids and uh, <laughs> and then like like it, it, like immediately just like oh hmm, okay nobody saw that you know like and then uh the last time was when uh he goes back to the treehouse and like all of the all of the townspeople are there and they're getting like all fucked up by the trolls and he climbs up the tree and he looks down he's like oh they're gonna blame me for this <laughs> uh like well, that's, is, that was his uh, first at, reaction at that point like uh, what is his reaction? That that's when he he fucking doesn't he pick up the bowling ball, and he does. Oh, that, that was monologue. right after. Yeah, he's yeah. like you know he does his little you know uh, whirl steps up to the plate or steps up to the line. It's a it's a ten seven split. Uh, uh, some shit, some shit, and he's like he bowls it and like it he and oh, hits well, the head of like falls one of on the, the chair or falls on someone's yeah. head. Right, it's like, it <laughs> falls on someone's head. And I was like, okay, that guy's dead. No, he just fucking he just killed in someone. His skull. <laughs> Which is great because that guy had a troll on his back as he's yeah. like fleeing, and then the right. fucking ball goes through the fucking hoop. Do you think he saved yeah. him from fate worse than death? <laughs> yeah, and then it's like the next like half minute of 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 Ernest like you know accepting an award for bowling and like thanking everyone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just like, like we should have done it like after everything was over. Like the sheriff just arrests him for killing that guy. <laughs> yeah, right. Like, oh yeah. By the way, like so like, he's dead, and it's your yeah, fault. Instead like, of Eartha yeah. Kit looking over. For him as he yeah. like falls in love with Rimshaw on the ground. She gives the him a funny come up look and like Even, fucking yeah. just cuffed him. Like, all right, <laughs> like, man, sorry, right. but go, Mr. Man. Jenkins was a part of our community. Then you then you cycle <laughs> back then back into Ernest goes to jail. Oh, that's right. how he goes to jail. Yeah. Yeah. For murder. <laughs> Great. And then he would have riot- ridden the electric chair. <laughs> oh, he did. <laughs> He did, yeah. No, he did, and then he got powers of magnetism apparently. Because oh, yeah. apparently Holy in fuck. that movie he was magnetic, and yes. that's <laughs> I've heard that. so we got a charge. Yeah, but right. uh, I've heard other people say that um, supposedly. I mean, obviously he plays the same character in every movie, but that there's kind of continuity between the movie continuity. But like, like in a town, you know, like mm-hmm. I don't know if that's. I don't know if you ever thought about that. It's like you know. Oh, never did. did whatever and now he's like a garbage man over there and the, uh, the earnest oh you're saying like universe. as the movies progress like the reason <laughs> the extended, he has these jobs and the shit? extended earnest universe there you go. yes <laughs> <laughs> that'd be, you know that'd well, be a, a good idea good, good, good to explore one, then it would make be, sense he goes from like 
janitor at a bank to fucking garbage man. Yeah, that would have followed. Well, that would be a good uh, thing to explore within the Ernest P. World universe to see how the movies are connected in some way or another. The world verse. Yeah, the world. <laughs> yeah, the world verse. <laughs> That's what we, should, we, we, we need to think of a name for this because I'm, I'm pretty sure it would be great to review the other fucking movies. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. I already did the world verse. It's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I like. I also like the the, the Ern- or extended Ernest universe. Uh, that one's pretty cool. Why would, so, how would you like abbreviate this extended? What's it, the um, EE? The EU? What the, EU. <laughs> EU. <laughs> Ernest, Slam Dunk Ernest? I didn't even know. Oh, you didn't know? You have, have, how you, many? have you seen that, Bryce? <laughs> have you seen Sorry, Slam Dunk man. Ernest, man? Oh, I haven't seen that, but... Who's the who, who's the basketball player in that on the Kareem on... Abdul Jabbar? Kareem... Oh man, <laughs> yeah. and he's yeah. the angel of basketball. Now I gotta watch this, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just seeing him like dunking it over him and shit. Oh man, yeah. Well, no, he defies physics in all ways. Like he's basically flying around like free will. Oh, yeah, to, man, like... that was from the that was from the city powers he got earlier. <laughs> yeah, from the shoe power. Yeah. yeah. So the angel, so the angel of basketball gives him these like shoes that basically have a mind of their own. And yeah. Ernest can't fucking control them. So he's like trying to walk and the fucking shoes are like but go play basketball or some bullshit. Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> <laughs> um I was trying to find like my favorite quotes. Uh, uh I've got one. It's uh, it's when uh, like right after he buys all that troll uh prevention shit from uh from uh Don and Bob. Oh, when he's walking down the stairs, at, yeah. yeah, like you, you hear the robot noises. Zit, 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 zit. Like he's just walking down. He says, "A virtual uh, reality of troll protection." Or yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I, I got it right here. You, you see before you a uh, state of the art uh troll fighter of was it troll fighter of tomorrow? This multi directional unitized high-tech fighting machine is salt free tuna safe and comes complete with 15 megabytes of double density wafer thin alloy uh, forming a virtual <laughs> reality of modern troll yeah uh, and that was key in there where he got scammed christ like the virtual reality <laughs> yeah. of troll protection like yeah <laughs> he had like a giant fly swatter strapped to his back like uh, I think and he, was, he and he used none of that no yeah he used, he used nothing i think i saw some nunchucks on there a flashlight on his life like it looked like he was wearing a lifeguard vest yeah <laughs> yeah uh, or, or, or a walking guard preserver but, yeah um one of those and then like i think he was holding up like what looked like a like a mop stick taped to a bunch of uh, like paint rollers or some shit. Like, yeah, and he didn't use any. Well, of that's that where shit. you put the milk. Oh, ha! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was great. Like, none of that made any fucking sense. I was like, oh, cool gibberish. Oh, I'm gonna write that down. Oh, <laughs> coolest kill in the fucking movie though was when the kid fucking had the box of powdered milk and it threw oh, it yeah, the fan and it hit the troll him. and it fucking. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty yeah funny. i that kid just backing he's backing up like looking all like Ooh, I'm scared, oh, he's like scared. real fake scared then, you know like, as that troll's walking towards him just smiles breaks out the fucking box of powdered milk throws the milk behind him and pff, it was did, pretty awesome did any of you guys think it was funny how like the cop uh his his dad gets cuffed to the to the to yeah the it's, like, it's like how did that happen <laughs> like and what the troll the troll the bullets? all the bullets and just yeah. like yeah. Him on the back of the head with a two by four and <laughs> fucking shooting I was like, wow man these guys are fucking <laughs> slick you know like they fucking took the bullets out of that gun like fucking nothing it's like oh i ate them it's like oh good intimidation no it really used them too <laughs> right like i was like that was just a cool not effect. how you'd expect but like couldn't he have just like just shot him with the gun <laughs> i was like wow that's a lot of extra extra well, i hassle. think their fingers are too big to hit that trigger you know what i mean i mean you would right you would think that but they weren't big enough to like take out the bullets you know, yeah, alone. You but that's and how you was, know that was a good sheriff. Like, there's one good cop out there, and that was the cop that was Kenny's dad in this movie because he's getting assaulted by these fucking creatures from hell, essentially. And he's like, freeze! <laughs> like, yeah. And he doesn't open fire. Like, 
<laughs> no, he doesn't. But but what he does, okay. But uh, he does draw his gun on what he thinks are the trolls the first time when Ernest like captures. Oh, yeah, he's opening up the fucking yeah. He's bin opening thing. the yeah. garbage bin and it turns out to be the mayor's kids. Like he's like Ernest starts trying to explain some shit to him. He's like Ernest, just open the damn uh, open the lid. Like and he like he cocks the does he cock the 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 gun or whatever. Like he just lifts it up and points it. I was like, wow, okay, dude, like. <laughs> Um, well, yeah, you gotta you gotta protect the town, man. I mean, you gotta just like. If, if, I mean, they, 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 but at this point, that they don't, they knew that the troll was around. They go right? from they, not they just, believing him to like, all right, we're gonna take this ser- like extremely seriously and just yeah, you know, we're gonna set up a posse yeah, exactly. yeah. now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I mean, it all goes to shit. But fucking um, like thirty cars show up to this fucking tree. Yeah, I thought they were just gonna like. Lit, like uh it was gonna be like a fucking mob or whatever and they're gonna you know like have pitchforks and, and, and lynch mob for the yeah exactly yeah control like yeah. For, for, for the trolls no for fucking Ernest, they're like no oh, yeah. it's all his fault and shit like they're coming after him <laughs> if we kill Ernest, <laughs> it'll all be okay <laughs> that would have been super funny <laughs> like if he if he'd have just like you know like it would start raining and shit and like you'd see thunder and lightning and just be like Ernest at the top of the uh uh, a treehouse screaming, I wanted to live, or whatever the fuck. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and they're just there. Rah, rah. I don't know. Well, um, I guess we can just, uh, if you all want to like talk about just uh, how the movie ends specifically, we did kind of br- br- talk about it a little I mean, bit. It was the Disneyest shit ever, which I mean, it had to be yeah. in there somewhere. Yeah, so dear, see, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, uh, the Miss Hackamore. Uh, I felt like she she whispered. She did whisper. She whispered. Yeah. Ernest is like, "Oh, <laughs> yeah, unconditional love, yeah. right? Like heart of a child. That's me. Yeah. I'll never grow <laughs> up. Ha. Huh? Okay. Like, so he picks up this fucking troll and spins it around slowly, like in a dance, <laughs> and then plants a kiss on his nose or something, and it comes back all slime on his Nosies. face, and so he goes like, eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
I can guarantee you went to the troll fix, man. Yeah, most definitely. Yeah. I mean, like Ernest was pretty much the main, the the only actor in there. Everyone else, again, hey, like fucking. What extra. about uh, Miss Hackmore, dude? Oh shit, that's. True. Oh, excuse me. You that's know what? She's right she's, there, man. she's the she's the guest star. That's what she, she just did. wandered onto the set, man. At that point in her career, she's like. <laughs> Remember when I was Catwoman? Wasn't that awesome? Yeah, I got the same wig. Oh, you don't mind if I live in the set you built for a while? <laughs> you remember when the USS government was mad at me for saying stuff against Vietnam? Right, right. I was, I was Black Catwoman, and I played, I played with with Mexican Joker. Nobody, nobody. <laughs> Which uh, actually, Eartha get, Kit did get into shit though, like because she did like say some shit against the Vietnam War or whatever, basically like, you know, we only send our kids to die or whatever. And then she got like blackballed for a while there. Uh, oh, really? Yeah. But uh, born, learned I mean, it from her Wikipedia this morning. Oh, hell <laughs> quest. Yeah. So, you know, that's legit. Wiki quest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> quest. There you go, man. Actually, Wiki quest would be interesting if we just like hit random on the searches and then talk about those. That could be <laughs> something we do. Everybody gets a random, a random search bullshit about it that uh one thing that. i um i do want to talk about the movie that get me a laugh it happened twice in this movie um is when he said like that he never knows when to quit ask yeah. my fourth grade yeah. teacher and then they cut to the teacher saying <laughs> he, he never knew when to quit the yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, just, he like dra- the drags his nails he on the never fucking knew when to quit Blah! and then yeah, yeah, but he goes. He he fucking uh drags his nail across the chalkboard as he's writing. Like I will not yeah. drag my nails across the chalkboard. He slaps his fucking head. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> happened twice, and I laughed pretty hard at both those times. I thought uh, I said I don't know when to quit. Who Ernest? On oh, the, yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah but he drags exactly. his nails, and then she like bangs his head against the fucking board. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's basically he says. Uh, I never knew when when to quit. Just that's my fourth grade teacher. Cut yeah. to the, the list. Is he? A, he never I remember, knew when to quit. And then pass. I remember he was wearing the hat, but like, did he have a vest when he was a little yeah. kid there too? Yeah, he, he did. did. <laughs> he had the same <laughs> getup, dude. Like, the same outfit all his life. Oh, his getup has awesome. not changed. It, it fucking like he grew did at with least him. get an elementary school education. So yeah, so his <laughs> his uh his clothes also went through puberty and grew a little bit. And <laughs> his, his inventor all lore of the uh, world world verse. There you go. Yeah, <laughs> all about that world verse. <laughs> uh, Roland, you know what's a uh, uh, tagline for this uh, episode when you write the the episode description? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Cinequest twenty six or twenty seven? Hugh, 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 Hugh. The world yeah. works. <laughs> um, do we have anything else to add if, before we get into ratings? Mm, I don't think so. I was trying I mean, to look. We, we, I mean, the... we covered pretty much most of the movie practically. Trying to see. Uh, I was trying to find out to see who did the the uh, the monster. Uh, costume whatever in the movie but doesn't have much information though right no it doesn't um that would probably have to do some like fucking internet deep dives or whatever the fuck uh, mdb but uh apparently the pizzas uh when they're throwing them at the bullies it's yeah. uh those are reused pop or reused props from teenage mutant Ninja. oh wow that's oh, cool. Nice. <laughs> I wonder if that pizza, yeah. So was that pizza when they loaded it into that weird arm thing when they're yeah. building the treehouse? They're like, here's this weird mannequin arm that's like bowed out a little bit, and they put the pizza in it, then they lift it up. Like, was that from TMNT? No, but the I well, well they said the pizzas were the pizzas. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not saying the mannequin arm, but like, I wonder if that pizza oh, oh. that they yeah, used in yeah. that one scene was oh, you know, I don't know. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's funny. Either way, like you guys kept this old shit. Like, all right, cool. Let's use it. <laughs> Put it yeah, in. For, for all, I mean, it could have been on on some of the same set as Ninja Turtles, you know. Nah. <laughs> okay, so um, again, yeah. we're gonna get into ratings, uh, and again, we do one through five, and um, I don't know who's gonna tagline this uh, uh, rating system, but. <clears throat> Just a real quick um, little thing here. On IMDb, um, this movie has a 5.7 out of 10 rating. 
and but on Google, uh, ninety one percent of Google users actually like this movie, so no surprise there. Yeah. Um. Actually, uh, we'll talk about a rating for this movie, and then we'll do like a quick uh, top three earnest movies. If you want to do that, sounds real quick. good. Just talk off the top of your fucking head. Um. So, um, how about Roland? You go first. Um, so, what was the? What was the? Uh, I was sorry. I was looking through some shit here. But what's the rating that we're using again? We're doing one through five, man. Five. We're not sure yet. As far as we're not sure it's yet. One, one, yeah, you know, X amount of pearls or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so, like the only thing I didn't like about this movie is, is, like I mentioned before. Oh man, I was just I was just looking at the the cover for Ernest Goes to Africa. I haven't seen that in so long. It's so that's so bad <laughs> with the stupid with that fucking yeah. mask. Yeah. Yeah. Oh <laughs> man, like oh, fuck. If that's gonna piss off any people or whatever the fuck they're like bitching about cultural appropriation. That's that's gonna be it. But who um, can get mad at Ernest? Oh, there was a whole team. Uh, Mm. And on cultural sensitivity on that, one. right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> um, it's parody. Like that's how that take it seriously because you have no joy in your life. I don't know. Fuck off. <laughs> um. So, like I said in the beginning, the only thing that I did not like about this movie, and you could have taken them out, like they didn't need to be in here, were the kids. Like pretty much, you know, what? if if they had left in the beginning of the movie, where. Uh, that little girl tells the story about the, you know, about the the uh, <clears throat> uh, the 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 legend of the troll, and then like they have their little one scene where it's like, ha, ah, the dork likes her, and then like it 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 passes over to Jim Varney, uh, and then like they could have had like maybe a, a few bit scenes where like the kids are captured and turned into wood, you know, and that would have been it. Like the movie would have been perfect. So I I would give this one like a four four and a half because everything else was fucking hilarious like uh Ernest Ernest is 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 a goddamn icon uh as far as i'm concerned and uh i mean yeah this movie this movie is fucking funny like this is this is also back when like you know they did what what is this movie is it rated PG13 or it's rated, PG it's rated PG it's rated PG PG right so like this is yeah. still when like they would they would still say stuff that like is kind of it's not necessarily edgy but it's still kind of dark you know where he's like again like like the one scene where the woman the the witch woman the nun tells him that like the troll is gonna gonna take all the kids and he's just like well just the kids like ha or <laughs> you know uh uh he he yells at the troll you know eat me i can die uh that kind of shit <laughs> um not quite something that that you're gonna see or at least i think you'll see in a fucking pg uh movie now so much um which i fucking loved i they they i would have i would have i would have rather seen a, like a few more kids uh get turned to you know petrified or whatever but that's that's just me. <laughs> and not come back right <laughs> yeah exactly like they just forget about them or something or like i mean at one point like the last kid that gets that gets you know uh turned into to wood like he flat out stomps shit, on him. Man. Yeah, he like he throws him on the ground. The troll throws him they on the ground and then <laughs> stomps on him. Like, <laughs> yeah. I'm like that's that's he's got to be dead. Like, no. Yeah, I was thinking uh, he's gonna bring his foot up and it's like the thing's gonna be cracked in half or some right, shit. Like, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and then and then they would. Well, like, he can't save them all. Nope. And, <laughs> like, and then and then the kid when when he stops and the kid comes back as like a dismembered like fucking corpse. Hey, he's so crippled or some shit. <laughs> yeah. oh, or, he's crippled. <laughs> or he's crippled. That would have been just, that would have been funny. Like his arms and legs are fucking <laughs> shit. He's like ah. Kill me. <laughs> I, the fucking Ernest. Should have left you dead. You know what I mean? <laughs> know what I mean, Vern? <laughs> uh, yeah, so like I'll, I'll give it a four, four and a half. Almost perfect. Four and a half out of five, right? Yeah. Um, uh, Bryce, uh, <laughs> what, what do you give this movie? Oh, well, um, I give it a four out of five, man. I. I I love this movie. Um, I loved it when I was a kid. Um, just introduced it to my kid. Uh, this liked it too. So uh, awesome. Um, I loved all the Ernest movies growing up. Uh, this one's probably my favorite. So I'm gonna give it a four out of five. All right, four out of five. Okay. Uh, five me acts. 
No. Five me. God damn it! Yeah. That's what I was going to use, Bryce. Thank there you. you. I, was, I, was actually, I knew I, I had to get to it for you, so I was like, <laughs> I was I was actually thinking about four and a half great white, uh, great redneck hopes or whatever. So, <laughs> there you go. Yeah. That's, uh, that's uh, the Miax. Well, that's a better one. Yeah, yeah, that was a good one. Okay, so how many Miax do you give this movie, Daniel? Four. Four out of five Miax. Oh yeah. Yeah. All right. Um. Season. I'll say it for myself too. It's uh, I give it a straight up four out of five. Of course, it's not a perfect movie, but it is very enjoyable, and it's you can rewatch it plenty of times. I saw it twice just today, and I was not bored with it for a second. Uh, <laughs> Man, like, uh, like, yeah. I mean, you can watch movies as kids. Sometimes when you you know see it, I got like three and a half pages of shit that I just wrote. Watch. Yeah, it's it's fucking What's up, man. It, I don't know. For me, it does. It's great stuff. <clears throat> okay. Um, top three see. earnest movies. Yeah, top three earnest movies. Uh, just real quick off the top of your head. Uh, we'll just mm. go back around. Daniel, uh, sure. what do you have your top three earnest movies? All right. Ernest in the Army. Oh, okay. Ernest Rides Again. And Ernest Goes to Jail. Okay, damn. <laughs> All right. Uh, I, okay, so wait. Those those top three are not in any order, right? You're just no, you're just not in any order, man. Just like no, top just three. your top three they're, they're favorite ones. Yeah. Okay, yeah, okay. Uh, I'll I'll go with uh, yeah. Ernest Scared Stupid has to be in there. I'm not sure I remember this one as well, but I'm gonna put it in there anyway. Ernest Ernest goes to camp, mm-hmm. and and uh, and and Ernest goes to jail. That one was one of my favorite. Uh, okay, it's yeah, fucking super. <laughs> it's so stupid. Um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, what about you, Bryce? Uh, what are your top three Ernest movies? Well, it's definitely this one. Uh, Ernest goes to jail. Yeah. Uh, honestly, man, it's probably gonna be controversial, but can you repeat that, Bryce? Because uh, yeah, cut you there. cut out, bud. Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say um, this one definitely is is my top one. Um, and then I I'd say Ernest goes to jail, and then uh, said the. And controversial is the uh, Ernest Saves Christmas. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I, was, I was about to ask. I'm you I'm waiting to watch that. that actual Christmas time. So like, I watched you, seven of the nine fucking Ernest movies. That's that's one of the ones I don't really remember. So. But you know, I you know it's, 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 it's scared so funny stupid is that... for Halloween and Christmas. I'll watch like in December at some point. I, I was surprised. Man, I gotta like, watch these other ones. I didn't even know there was an Ernest goes in the Ernest in the Army. Man, yeah, I didn't yeah, know yeah, yeah, dude, yeah. I was surprised um, we didn't add that to the top uh, like sure, is movie Christmas sure movies out? when we did it last year. <laughs> he should have, though. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Ernest and the Army is the buddy. last Ernest movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, which one was the last Ernest movie? Ernest in the Army. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Because I, I thought okay. it was Ernest Goes to Africa. Uh, let me give you my top three again. It's... Uh, Ernest, uh, Ernest scared stupid. Ernest goes to jail. Ernest goes to camp. Still, Ernest goes to camp is probably like my favorite though. Okay, so with my list though, I left out Ernest scared stupid because that's that's obviously in my top. And I guess my number four would be uh, Ernest goes to school, which is a fucking funny one, man. <laughs> All um, right. No, yeah. Okay. Okay, uh, so I, so I guess here we just, are. I guess we're <laughs> yeah, this episode took us. Well, what happened? Yeah. You, you know, it's uh, it's funny. It's like at this time of night, like it feels like the internet starts to kind of like wave right. I'm assuming everyone's on porn line right now. Pornhub, yeah. just yeah, Pornhub, YouTube, Pornhub again, X videos, whatever. You porn, yeah, get, <laughs> yeah. get it, kids. <laughs> um, okay, Reddit. so I'll just uh, do our closing bit here. Uh, Again, we talked about uh, Ernest Scared Stupid, and this is our Halloween episode. Um, anyone special. out there who's this uh, Halloween special episode? If anyone is listening, <laughs> if anyone is listening and they want to tell us their favorite Ernest movie and actually like Ernest movies, I mean, please let us know. Uh, subscribe to us on uh, Google Podcasts, iTunes, Spotify. Uh, rate and review us on those things as well. Uh, follow us on all the social medias: Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Uh, preferably Facebook and Twitter. I mean, I'm sorry, uh, Instagram and Twitter. I don't really like Facebook too much. But, um, yeah, yeah and uh, if you want to 
give to our Patreon. Uh, we have those different tiers that you can uh, give to, and uh, you'll get various types of content that we have. Uh, we've been kind of collecting over the past couple months now. Uh, there are a few uh, exclusives in there, unedited episodes. Um, they get like you'll get like the raw format of pretty much episodes that we do that I could not for the life of me uh, leave to the free public because it's yeah. kind of ridiculous. Speaking of the free public, though, I think one thing I'll throw up on the various media sites is me and the earnest costume I'm going to be doing this next Dude, week. Dude, for so, real, do that shit. Yeah. Awesome. <clears throat> I mean... I got you guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's awesome. Just just like get a couple... <laughs> just walk around calling everybody Vern and saying you know what I mean. Well, and- <laughs> yeah, and I want to like have a plunger with me at work too so i can go like uh-huh. fix problems that come up or whatever get a, <laughs> get, a, get, a, get a get like a fucking tool belt or whatever and yeah put, put like you a know plunger you know what i did not know about a fl- this movie a fly swatter and a spatula about his character was that Vern was supposed to be the audience yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I, I did not know well, that well that was, always, the, so, was from commercials yeah 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 that's exactly so right. yeah that's the thing about his character he's always breaking the fourth wall always looking at the fucking when he, whenever he does, and that. so Vern was the f- fourth wall for us. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's good okay. stuff, man. Yeah. So yeah. Um, we enjoy Ernest over here at MoQuest Studios, and oh, I hope so much love the fuck well. out of him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, we all express such excitement whenever we acquired all the Ernest collection, and yeah, now that we have it at our disposal, we are extremely happy about it. Pleasantly um, surprised to see yes, all of that. Yes. And and surprised, I mean, that everyone kind of has the same uh, amount of excitement for it, uh, unless uh, it's Jamie, uh, who does not. Well, that's Jamie. You know, that's just, Jamie. That's I Jamie mean, I, I just, I, I think it's not that he doesn't like them. He just doesn't necessarily care. Because, I mean, the last time we were chilling at his place, he put he put on Scared Stupid without, like, half a thought. So I was like, all right. Hmm. I would think he just did it to try it, too. But, I mean, like, even yeah, when, I, but. Uh, <clears throat> But he didn't change yeah. it, and he didn't talk, no, he didn't, so yeah. that was the thing. Like he was quiet. So. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a like, oh, this is this is fucking stupid. Like, why did I why did I get this? No, like, so I mean, it's not a total loss. Whatever. Yeah. Well. <laughs> okay, so um, that'll be it for <laughs> Cinequest video, the Halloween special. Last year we did top ten horror movies. So if you want to go back and listen to that one, feel free to do so. That one is mm-hmm. like close to three hours long. So holy fuck. Um, yeah. Yeah, so 55 you know, minutes versus three hours, you know. Just, yeah, you just, know. Uh, <laughs> just hear it in just pieces, it you know. And uh, you'll hear myself, Roland, and Bryce go into discussion about our favorite top 10 horror movies. And, of course, sure. um, the shit talking that goes along with it because we were <laughs> drinking at the time. So enjoy that if you feel the need to. Um, so, uh, again, oh, yeah, that was Quest my video. first time being on the show. Yes, that was Bryce's oh, first time being on the show. Yeah. So, you consider this his uh, anniversary uh, episode with MoQuest <laughs> Studios. Um, <laughs> we got pretty trash that night, didn't Mo- we? Yeah. Mo 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 Choose. What what are we talking about now? Mo Mo Kuiest. Wow, sounds exotic. Yeah. So uh, again, kind Halloween special. Bird. Thank you for listening. My name is Ray, and then we have Roland. Yeah. That's yeah, what I thought. Uh, oh, Daniel. Yeah. <laughs> Say goodbye, Daniel. I'll see you guys. And we have Bryce. Thankfully, was able to join us. So after technical difficulties, technical which difficulties, always arise, yeah, it's always happening. God damn. Oh, I know better. <laughs> <laughs> um, everything that's happened to you tonight, Bryce, has happened to us every single like every. it happened to us like numerous times in the past when we we're trying to get everything you have no away. fucking idea man yeah. it's so frustrating like getting ready like hour and a half in then it's like fuck okay can we record now maybe yeah. no <laughs> we're not ready i know half hour goes by shit yeah, yeah. Uh, but Post- thankfully uh your technical problem was resolved quickly right. so i, I think it's because of the experience we've had we just look on some articles and kind of give us uh just cross the fingers uh, and yeah uh, it's also we pray, cross your fingers, yeah, right. draw like a pentagram on the ground. There you go. And <laughs> hope for the best. <laughs> Turn in place three times. You know. yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, rip off pube hair, burn it, you know, like all that kind there of shit. There you go. 
Um, yep. Okay, yep. so we'll see you next time. Uh, next year's Halloween episode. So, peace out. Ah, ah, what? All right.